Hi YouTube, in this video I'm going to demonstrate how to insert 360 degree metadata or metadata if you're from the US into your 360 video so you can upload it to YouTube and either view it in VR or just swipe around in 360 degrees so stay tuned. Virtual Reality 360 TV Hi YouTube and welcome back this is only a short video so it's not very complicated and very very easy to do so let's get started right okay so first of all I've uploaded this video to YouTube that doesn't have any metadata injected into it and as you can see YouTube just stretches it out as a flat 360 degree video and there's not much you can do with it apart from you know change the quality and whatnot okay and then on this video is the same video that has had the metadata injected into it and as you can see YouTube has now picked it up as a 360 degree video and you can swipe around with it also if you're viewing this on a mobile device you will have the little um, Google Cardboard icon down here so if you click on that then you can view it in a VR headset but if you don't insert the metadata that's that's what it will look and I've done a few videos where I've forgot to insert the metadata and when I've played it back and it's you know it's being flat and I thought oh, I'm gonna have to do it all again so that's with the metadata and that's without okay so how do we do it then so it's nice and easy you go to this link which I will put in the description uh, this particular site it's endorsed by Google so it's pretty safe to download so you basically download the program and it's a small executable file that looks like looks like this which is uh, looks like a little duck on a floppy disk an old floppy disk so okay click on that and run it okay opens up this little window so we'll just click on open and select the file okay so it's telling us it's not found any metadata but it's given us the option to click in this spherical so click save as now what it does is it is it automatically names the file underscore injected now what you're best doing is leaving it like that and click and save if you change at this point if you change the file name it doesn't inject the metadata so if you just leave it like that click save it's now saving successfully saved open it up so there is the file now and now you are actually safe to give it a different name okay and that is basically it nice and simple if you upload that now to YouTube it will pick it up as a 360 degree video just like this one and that's it very simple um, if you've got any questions about it just leave me a comment and I will reply and don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you all very soon so thanks a lot bye bye virtual reality 360 TV